Take them off. Don't go on there. Good morning, guys. Um, welcome to another video. This is like my morning routine while working on my work day, I guess. Um, remember when I first get up, I go to the bathroom and I do the duty. I don't even brush my teeth. I go to the bathroom and use the bathroom really good at first. And then sometimes Bay will get up and take the dog out, but this morning, I look, so I'm gonna take them out and then come back in and shower and find something to wear and get ready to start my day. So, y'all come on with me. And if you ask anybody where I live, the point to the hills and say, Go all the way up, go all the way up, go all the way up. Say good morning, whiskey. Come here, come here. No, stop biting. Say good morning. Yeah, hey, say good morning to the people. You ready to go outside? Come on, let's go outside, puppy. Let's get you a little pinky baby. No, come here. Come. He's every morning thing. He never wants to cooperate. Come on. I like to take him out before we take him, before we feed him. Just so that once we feed him, it gives me some time to um, shower and stuff while we're letting his food digest and everything. Go ahead. So he'll go sniffing around out here for a little while before he poops and pees. And he normally has to poop every single morning, which is why we wait to feed him after we take him out because we know that he's gonna have a full poop. So excuse his poop, look at his little innocent face. <laughs> and yes, I clean up after my dog. For those of you who don't, clean up after your damn dog. So it takes a second, little nasty hose. Alright, so I am back in from taking the dog out. And what I normally do is just come into my work area and I open up the blinds, just kind of let some sun in. Um, and I do this before I clean up or do anything because I hate working in the dark and I also really like natural light. This is my raw, uncut version of my morning routine before I get ready for work. It's nothing spectacular. This is also my rushed morning routine. I'll have to do a. Um, another morning routine when i'm just actually getting ready today i'm just getting before did you finish your food boy did you finish your food he likes to hide and play in my room in my work area but i'm gonna put him up and then i will start my day and wash my face and everything so before i get in the shower guys i normally go through and brush my teeth and everything which i'm sure you guys know how to brush your teeth this is my tutorial um but yeah, I'm gonna brush my teeth real quick. Speak through this. <sighs> now that I brush my teeth, what I like to do is go in with my face wash. Now, if you guys know, I love to do face masks and I also love to do products that's like customized for my skin. As y'all see, I have a lot of dark spots on my skin and like freckles and stuff. So I like to use my Mix Easy Face Cleanser. And the Mix Easy Face Cleanser is pretty much a face cleanser that is customized just for your skin type. So you can go on the website, you can pick any product that you want to go in your face wash. So if you have like acne or dark skins, they have so many different products that you can choose for. And I will say that you customize it on the site and you can give it your own name. Mine, I decided to name Flame It or Flame, yeah, it was Flame It. So I'm gonna put a screen record on the screen just so y'all can see exactly what you guys can do when you go on the site. So you go into the site and you select face and then you scroll down to um, custom products. So it has custom and then face cleanser. So it has custom face cleanser. I'm sorry, it'll be a screen other thing. And then you click minus normal to combination. So I click normal to combination and you just hit next. Okay, so here's a close up view. Once you hit next, you can pretty much add up to five natural ingredients of your choice. And I chose um, rose hip extract. I also chose um, linen tree extract. I thought I chose kiwi for this one, but I believe I accidentally hit parsley. And then I ended up choosing like a honeycomb. Um, and that is what gave it my smell. 
and you just give it the name that you want as i said i named this the flaming flame mat of course for you guys because my girls are the flame mats and my guys whatever you are and then once you name it you add it to your cart and then you scroll down you enter my code corsha lachelle and that will help you to get um 15 percent off of your total balance and i'm about to show you right now how much it's going to deduct so my face cleanser was 29 dollars, and then once you enter my code corsha lachelle that's c-o-r-s-h-a-l-i-s-h-e-l-l -L, it'll be on the screen and the description box it will take five dollars off for you so i mean you can't beat that something that's customized for the your skin smell of mine is really like it smells like honeycomb or um i don't know if you guys remember the little things that we used to eat back in the day those little honey sickles that's exactly what it smells like and the texture of it is very very thin which i like which lets me know that it is water-based yeah which lets me know they're not putting all these crazy things in it and it's always fresh ingredients it's not it's not something that they that they make in advance and they put on the shelf for you no you order it and they make it when you order it, which it may take some time to get to you. Actually, my order only took about, was it five days, if that, to get to me, but they make it and customize it right when you order because it's customized right for your skin. When I purchase products from the drugstore, typically it's like, like I have one that's for acne or that's a deep exfoliating one. That's a generic brand. It could be for any skin type. This is just for my skin. So if you guys want to get a product that's good for your skin, that's customized for your skin, you can go to mixeasy.com, which will be in the description box below. And be sure to use my code Corsha Lachelle for 15% off. So if your order comes up to, what, 25 bucks, you're gonna get 15% off of 25 bucks. The products are very, very, very expensive and it is perfect for your skin. And I promise y'all, I don't just put anything on my skin and I don't just market or advertise any and everything. I'm sorry for that quick little advertisement. I just wanted to give y'all a good product because you know I like to put y'all on when I use a good product. But I'm gonna go ahead and wet this and put my face wash on. And you don't even need that much of this product. I just normally use about three pumps. You can really use two. And it's very liquidy, so be careful. I don't know what happened. So my little spinny thing is supposed to spin, but it's not spinning. So I'm just gonna go ahead and just like scrub my face with it it's by itself and this stuff is just so mild and so light on my skin i'll wash my face for about two minutes and then i hop in the shower and i'll be washing my hair in the shower not washing my hair probably like doing a co-wash or rinsing it out oh, but look at this stuff like it just dissolves and disappears but okay, yeah, I'm gonna rinse this off and I will see y'all when I get out of the shower. Hold on, bitch. You don't. Hold on, bitch. Bae, can you iron my clothes for me? Is that a yes or a no? Every morning. I'm just too lazy to do it on my own, so I asked her to do it. But yeah. So now that I am all showered, I am. I am just gonna put some D.O.D. on the wall. Put some oil on, some lotion. The oil that we like to use, if you've been following us me for a while, you know I like to use this oil. I just put this on real quick. Because keep in mind, I'm only going to the living room to do hair. And I'm gonna be doing hair there all day long. So, I mean, I want to smell good, but I ain't got to put on like no Chanel or no fancy nothing. So, I'm just going to put on a little bit of oil to be fragrant and um, put my clothes on. Here's my Eco Styling Gel. That's my bubble clock in the back. We don't need nothing fancy. And that's that. Nothing too fancy. But yeah, come on. We're going to go get dressed. So now that I am ready for work, I just got on the champion shirt and some jeans. I'm going to straighten up my pillows, get whatever hair that I need to get together. Together. I broke a coffee table. We don't have a coffee table, so I don't have to clean that up.
so I pretty much have straightened up my area, got everything that I need to get together for my first client. And now I'm probably about to make me and bay a smoothie and re watch this and refill this or get another water bottle. And that is pretty much what I do. Let me turn out this way so y'all can see me. And that is pretty much what I do to start my day to get ready to do hair. Um, it's not anything too fancy. It's just something really quick, really simple. I make sure I wipe down with a disinfectant wipe, spray, or whatever. I do have my um, my thermometer, and I do have my hand sanitizer, and I do have my box of masks for my clients. So just in this time, um, let me let y'all up a little bit. Hold on. You know, just because we are going through are recovering from a pandemic, I make sure that I have my mask on with my clients. I make sure that my client's temperature is at a normal rate or a normal um, Fahrenheit or degree. And yeah, so I hope you guys like this video. Be sure to leave a comment in the comment section below for what you want to see next. The content is going to be just comment consistently. It may be stuff like this. It may be stuff with me out. But with a lot of stuff not going on, you may see a lot of me doing stuff in. I will be filming a video like a get ready with me uh, because I'll be going out to a day party on Sunday. So I will film that so you guys can see me get ready. But yeah, thank you guys for watching this video. If you're new to the cookie jar, welcome to the cookie jar. Girl, it's your girl, question, Lachelle. We end this to win this on the way to 10K, on the road to 10K again. Like, comment, subscribe. Tell a friend to tell a friend to join the cookie jar with you. What fun has been in the cookie jar if you're the last cookie in the cookie jar? So yeah, I love you guys. And let me get ready to do some hair.